So I'm gonna show you how to change your power supply on your gaming PC. And the first things that you wanna do are removing the panels. There'll be four screws located on this gaming PC. Sometimes you might have two screws located on the side over here. And you wanna take these out because your motherboard connections will be here. Before we take out the power supply, we're gonna we're gonna take out this connector, this connector right here. That's your 24 and your four pin connector. This might be an eight pin connector depending on your board, and the power supply normally will come with it. We're also gonna take out the SATA connections for the hard drives. And in case your fan or your case has LEDs, the SATA power cable for the LEDs as well, which is this one here. So. case it's wired in you may need to remove any cable ties or anything like that but normally you can just feed them out through the back of the board like this and make sure that they're fully out separated because now we're gonna unscrew the power supply itself with the four screws First connection. The second. Third one. And 
then the fourth. Okay. And we're gonna come to the side and remove the cable tie for the passport. And the first connection that we do is the 24 pin. We feed it through this hole in this end and connect it up to the 24 pin here. Then you take the 8 pin. If your board only supports 4 pins, you just remove the left one and you keep the right one. And feed it through the top and put it down. Then any SATA connections you would connect up now to. So there's our hard drive and we're gonna take this SATA cable, put it in to the connection right there. Last thing we need to grab is the LED connectors, and that can also be done with a set of connector. And we put that in and make sure it's connected as well. In case you have a drive that's up here as well, there you may need a set of connection as well. That in from underneath and make sure that's flush underneath. And that's everything to do with the password. You can close up the case again and that'd be fine. If you don't have something that can feed through the top here, you can feed it through the the bomb over there. What this means is you'll drag the wire from the bottom and then drag it to the top where it connects up there. You might need to remove the graphics card so you can take out the screws from the side panel here to remove the GPU and then plug out the wire in case you need to replace it. But the same connections go. 24 pin and then the SAT connections behind.